Welcome back to The Real Deal and today we're going to discuss why 2021 is still the year to sell your house. If you're trying to decide whether or not to sell your house, this is the time to think seriously about making a move. Fannie Mae's recent home purchase sentiment index reveals the number of respondents who say it's a good time to sell is higher now than it was over the past few summers. Today, the majority of consumers, 75%, say it's a good time to sell a house. The higher good time to sell sentiment has to do with today's market conditions, specifically low housing supply and high buyer demand. In the simplest of terms, we don't have enough houses available for sale to meet buyer demand. According to the latest data from the National Association of Realtors, we're still firmly in a seller's market because housing supply is well below a balanced norm. Clearly the scales are tipped in a seller's favor today, but while housing supply is undeniably low, the right side of the graph shows how the inventory situation is improving little by little each month. As a seller, that means each month buyers have more options to pick from. By extension, that means your house may get less buyer attention with time. Danielle Hale, chief economist for Realtor.com, explains it like this, quote, more homeowners continue to list homes for sale compared to a year ago. Notably, while new listings continue to lag behind the more normal 2019 pace, the gap is shrinking even though homes continue to sell quickly thanks to high demand and limited supply, new listings are subtly shifting the balance of market conditions in favor of buyers. So, what does that mean for you? If you've been waiting for the perfect time to sell, there may not be a better chance right now. Inventory is gradually increasing each month, so selling sooner rather than later will help you maximize your home's potential. Here's the bottom line, ladies and gents. If you're planning to sell your house, 2021 is still the year to do it. The unique mix of low supply and high demand won't last forever. So let's connect to discuss what you need to do to sell your house and take advantage of this seller's market. That's all we've got time for today on this episode of The Real Deal. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. It will mean the world to me and we'll see you next week.